All right. All right. Yeah, ready for this? And everyone's saying for this episode? No, we're not talking about nothing. I mean, right. the disclaimer is about the, <laughs> the nigga tree is about to be. <laughs> Look, court, court in full effect. Court in full effect. Hosts are not responsible for oh, any yeah. opinions stated on this episode. All right, they are our opinions, and we can say we want, but you know, take it as strictly our opinions. All right, they're not to be used as professional advice or taken to heart. The mis- we, we this funny. We prep for these. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, warn, warn you now if you don't come with the misogynistic stuff, because hey. one of these is wild. Straight wild. Two, no, two of them. Two of them are, no, well, all, they're all wild. They're all wild. That's what podcast files are, but two of them are are definitely. The first one we just want, we just, yeah. let's just drive, dive straight into it. You want to go first? Yeah, yeah. All right, I'll, let me see. Let me queue it up. All right, yeah, so. We got, we got a, uh, we'll play the, vi- we have videos. We play videos, we have videos. No, uh, crap. Uh, what's, it called? what's the disclaimer? Fair use, fair use. I think yeah. that's what I say. But, you know. These are tweets that are public, yeah. that are available. Like, if I sent you the link, you anybody can get to them. Okay. It's like GPL for our coders out there, general public license. Everybody can use it, all right? Open source. <laughs> yeah. It's on GitHub. Everybody can see this. It's not hidden. Anyways. All right. So the context for our first one before we play the video is a couple, right? A couple and then the 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 male's mom, right, is in the front seat. The husband's mom. Husband. Is that, are they married? Okay. The That's husband's mom. I'm just telling your wife. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The husband's mom is in the front seat. And they're picking up the wife from a, a location. I know. It's, yeah, we don't know where they at. All right, from a location. <laughs> she wanted to act like she read the bottle. So hey, she, she out here somewhere. She in these streets. Okay. <laughs> no, no, not the wife. And the, <laughs> and the wife and the mom is sitting in the front seat. And the wife asked the mom to get in the back seat, and she said no. And then you know the the argument escalates from there. All right. right. So we gonna we gonna play the video for it. Should we play the video? It's a lot yeah, of play the video. Also, right. too, this may or may not be fake. We don't, we don't know. know. I'm like 75, 25 on it. Either way, we want some serious. Yeah, yeah, it, it still stimulates the conversation. I'm in the front seat, and I get that that's your mom, and I'm but I go into the back, right? No, that's not. Why? What are you talking about? I'm your wife. Are you serious right now? We got, we got to keep having these type of conversations every time. Every time I make up with your mother, it's always a problem. I'm in his life now, so why are you still here? I'm always gonna be. Okay, but go to the back fucking seat. is running is just running over in her grave she is <laughs> rolling over all this go to the back go to the back <laughs> shout out to adorn josie too we always talk about the ad names of where we got this video from we will make sure we give y'all credit it is the ad name is a d o r n j o e z e e adorn josie and this video was posted 07 26 20 all right so this one we had this one our guy for a minute uh, yeah, we we I think that one of the first things we did is do a podcast. <laughs> it's the podcast file. We're like, yeah, let's just start clipping these and putting them. So I guess the question is, fellas, if your mom is in the back, where's your comment? Where's your comment? Where's your quote tweet? Oh, my, my, I'm sorry, my comment. So my quote tweet was when I when we originally found this video was her argument wasn't wrong, her approach was, mm-hmm. and then I said let's get into it. Your wife comes before your mother. Keyword is wife, though, and I capitalize wife. W-I-F-E. Your wife, though. Your right. sponsor. Yes. So, I still stand on that argument, right? Uh, <laughs> what I said when I found this video is the same way I think I'm going to approach it now, right? So, if my mom was in the front seat, right? And I think, and that's part of what makes me think this is, might be staged, right? I mean, it's, it's, it's also different, right? I guess it depends on your mother. I know my mom well enough to know if I pull up, right? My mom's in the front seat, and this is my wife's vehicle, right? I pull up to pick my wife in my wife's vehicle, and I'm driving, and I'm already with my mother because that, that makes a difference. She said it was her car. She did say it was her car. So ownership, right? Ownership is a thing. I'm pulling up in my wife's SUV with my mother in the front seat to pick up my wife. Chances are my mom is just going to get out and get in the back. 
she might. Let me be very clear. She might be in the back seat anyway. Or ready for week Yeah. <laughs> Let's not get too logical. <laughs> right. I'm just saying just from the fact that my mom is my mom and she, she my mom enjoys, she relishes in the fact of being able to be chauffeured at this point. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Like, my mom been been thugging it her whole life. You feel me? Like, so the fact that I can drive her around and, you know what I mean? And she can be in the back and just be chilling. She probably would relish in that idea. So she probably wouldn't be in the front seat to begin with. But if she was, I don't think she would have an issue with getting out and getting in the back seat for my wife which makes sense so i don't even understand all this right it's, it's a lot of debate going on back and forth for something that shouldn't even be, need to be discussed uh -oh. not to mention okay we always give the different perspectives right so i'm married cory single right yep. well i am single okay cory single nah, i was like look i don't i'll never want to be look i don't ever want to speak for let me not get in trouble okay. i'm in a relationship hey. I'm, I'm single <laughs> hey oh, which one which one which one which one you want to go ahead why you being weird to me? Nah, this how I be in it. It's over nine. <laughs> oh shit! Here we go again. Look, also, <laughs> also, when we talk about that two minute rule, it'd be a joke. No, <laughs> for some of y'all, hey, hey, it's not. Shout out to my fifty five second brothers. Hey, okay, be like that. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. We're really not supposed to clap like that, but this is just this is just too much right now. Yeah, it just it. I don't understand all the unnecessary hostility. I, just, I mean, even if, okay, so let's, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna play it. So I gave y'all a whole bunch of alternative uh, situations, right? I didn't necessarily answer the question. If my mom was in the front seat and she refused to rem remove herself from the front seat for my wife, as I'm picking my wife up in her vehicle, I would politely ask my mother, who is still my mother, to get in the back seat, right? That's your wife, all right? Are we gonna get biblical on them for a little bit, Corey? We gonna bring, we gonna bring, uh, look, yo, I, okay, so I need to look at <laughs> Which verses? Yeah, which I was gonna say I need to look up the. Your mom's supposed to get in the back. Look, I know you're supposed to honor thy mother and thy father. Let's be clear, okay? However, your wife, you are in a relationship. That's your wife, man. Your wife is the. So I, this is how I always look at again the married perspective, right? My wife, me and my wife are ground zero for my life, right? If if something falls out with you or your significant other, your your partner, right? Your your wife. Let's be very clear, not your partner. Your wife. Let me. I gotta use the actual terminology here. Um, that affects everything immediately happening in your life, right? Um, respectfully, my mom does not live with us. And some people, even if your mom does live with you, your mom should still technically not be included in your, your ground zero. I call that like the epicenter of my life, right? Something mm. happens between me, my wife, you know what I mean? Or if you, for people who have kids, you, your wife, your children. Per, me, me, media, it's a media family. Yeah, a media called. family, right? There's a ripple effect that affects everything. You know what I'm saying? You know how you drop something in the water and it, it starts in the center and everything else goes out? The, your, your media family is the center. That's the, 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 the impact starts there, right? So anything outside that first ring, that circle, that immediate impact, that ground zero, right, is, is, is secondary, all right, mm -hmm. or tertiary, or whatever you want to call it. It's after, uh -oh. okay? Uh -oh. Okay, we start putting numerics on it. It's, it's we, zero. My wife is zero, okay? We, we are zero. So that being the case, uh, mom's got to get in the back, you know? And I'll be, I would mom's got to get in the back. Mom's got to get in the back, okay? <laughs> and I'll be respectful, you know what I'm saying? I get out the car, open my mom's door up, open up, you know what I mean? Open up the back seat, she can walk out, make sure I hold the door open for my wife so she can get in, make sure they all strapped up, close both of their doors, because you can be respectful about it. And I think that's what I meant by her argument was wasn't wrong but her approach was right because you can't okay so from the wife's perspective the wife can't come you can't come up can't pull up on mom. yeah you can't pull pull up on my, my mom been pulling up on people longer than we've been alive okay let's be very clear <laughs> so she stay ready okay you're not about to come up and start talking crazy out the side of your neck to my mother. She she don't care who present. You anybody can get it. My okay? mom's gonna, my mom's gonna call you a heifer. That's literally. <laughs> <laughs> that must be a down south thing. Cause that listen. It's from the Bible. Yeah, the heifers <laughs> in the Bible. That's why I say you want to get biblical. It's in the Bible. <laughs> Oh, I was like, well, you a heifer. It's straight like that. That's like a goat or something like that. I thought it's it was a, a small calf. Isn't okay, it? yeah, go calf It'll goat. Be, right. it. That's the OGB word though. It like, is. They not call. They don't call you a dog. They call you another animal. What is that? Yeah, heifer. Is it dust color right? I think that's an F. No, I went with Urban Dictionary. Oh, no, 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 no. See, like, he did. Dialect of Ebonics, meaning extremely yeah, busy a young woman who's always been. <laughs> So the, yeah. the actual definition is a young female cow. Yeah, Look. see, our moms are old. They're going to call you a, a, a calf, not Look. a dog. Right. They're going to call you a cow. They're going to call you a cow. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, look at that fucking right. I can see my mom doing this. I'm not going to say that about you, mom. I love you. It just rolled out the tongue. Like it's right. <laughs> As they say, you lucky I'm saved. Right. <laughs> Y'all know. Yeah, I'm not going to do this. Y'all, if, if you know, you know. You know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Our moms, our moms, old school. Okay, yeah. they could have told you off and not even. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You won't even. You have to go. Now you got me. Words. Now you got me cussing. Right. <laughs> I'm like, are you? <laughs> That's not how it works, mom. They said even if it's in your spirit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you pre it's premeditated already. You know what I'm saying? That means it was it was in you. It was deep down. Yeah, that's that's what the sin the curse. What do I know? You read the you read the Bible. <laughs> the, the, so I mean, you know, you more more, more well versed than I am. So. Oh gosh, we, we love y'all. We love y'all. Thanks, okay. moms. Right, thanks, mom. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So you go tell you go tell your mom. Yeah. I'm, I know, no, you can't pull, talking, on, yeah, you can't yeah. pull up on my mom. Yeah. Life's perspective, right? You so be respectful, right? There's you. I think us as a, okay. So now we just we taking a step back. Us as a community, okay. We have to learn how to have a conversation or a difference of opinions and not necessarily escalate in tone or you know what I mean. Get loud or start using these bondings or derogatory language. You know what I'm saying? There is. A, Are you talking about me? No. <laughs> <laughs> I left the shoe. <laughs> I was like, mm. Ooh, there's, there's an art to having a conversation with contrasting opinions and still being able to reach a compromise or agree to disagree, but still not disrespect one another, right? Uh, that's called debating, right? People, It's a lost art. I know a lot of people don't do that anymore. It's probably not even as popular as it used to. I know it used to be a thing at schools, right? Like you could sign up for a debate team, right? Yeah. And debate is basically logically proving your point that might be contrasting from your, you know, the, usually what happens is they have an issue and then one person proves the A side and the other the other team proves the B side, right? Mm -hmm. And they're usually contrasting opinions. But in that debate, usually there there's some stern um, opinions put out, but there there's usually no disrespect back and forth, right? It's it's just opinion A versus opinion B and right. the people who logically prove out their opinion, you know, usually win, right? So that being said, you gotta take that to everyday life, right? There's a way to say, you know, as opposed, as opposed to calling her a heifer and a bitch and some, you know, some other things. You, <laughs> excuse me, Miss, you know, insert last name here. You are currently in the, you know, in the passenger seat of my vehicle, and I would like to ride in front with my husband. Is it okay if I do? Could you please step to the back seat so I could do so? Right, calm, cool, and collected. Notice how my, there was no inflection in my voice. Nothing changed. I didn't insult her. I told her exactly what the situation was. I said, "This is my vehicle, so I'm stating ownership. So even if he doesn't." ask you to move i'm asking you to move because i own the vehicle right so you got to put that's you see you got you see you got to put some points in there right because technically if that's your husband's mom he should do it right i think there's an order well, to technically yeah, who, should, saying, who should be asking who to move in-laws now do my in-law conversation right mm -hmm. i'm just i'm saying it as it so this again bringing it i can always use myself an example right i'm going to ask my my mom to move so my wife doesn't have to ask my mom to move does right. that make sense right that is don't how it that, should go yeah don't create that situation right you know what i'm saying remove that that layer hostility between them before it even happens if you or if i even know this is gonna be a thing when we get up there you know what i'm saying i might have the conversation way over like my okay mom we got to pick up fear kids you know we get there can you just go ahead and get in the back you know what i'm saying you that way you don't even have to have an exchange on site right you know what i'm saying you got that i don't know where they was coming from but you probably got at least 10 to 15 minutes before you get there you feel me like <laughs> talk to your mom on the way over there just or just casually mention it right then it's not a big deal you know what i'm saying I feel like the deal is as big. This again, the approach was all wrong. This made it this confrontation. Yeah, it went to ten before. So there was never, you know what I'm saying. So even if she didn't have a problem moving, the way she approached it, or she got a problem moving it. My mom is that type of person, right? If you're gonna, yeah, don't start, don't start, don't start, don't start, don't like you're gonna come out here with the heat. She didn't have a problem, but now you got a problem. You got a problem. You know what I'm saying? So just saying all that to say, the approach was off. Be respectful, husbands. You know, your wife is, again, at the epicenter of your life with you, right? So you need to handle business. Ask your mother to get in the back seat. Be respectful. Open all their doors. You know what I'm saying? You just got to make them feel good about it, right? Like, you know, oh, <laughs> open their doors. Make sure there's no disrespect flying back, you know, from either party, right? Mm -hmm. And then you're good to go. And that's 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 where my, my take on it. Yeah. Well, this is probably something where, like, I don't even got to go. Because, like, it's, I'd just be repeating what literally <laughs> everything you just said. As you said, I mean... I was gonna say one more. Oh, go, go, go. And I was gonna say one last point. Again, all this is for for wife, wife, uh, 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 uh. wife, wife is the key word. I, I even put that in the tweet. Key word is wife, though. Now, 
if it's your if it's your so well, if the fiance too fiance has a good yeah, friend too yeah fiance, fiance. Good friend too. okay fiance, yeah so because for people who don't know fiance is our wives to be right? right so you know you have yeah. you've officially made that commitment statement. yeah right commitment. so we're we're just planning the the ceremony or we just haven't legally done it yet and right she planning and you're just getting drunk along and with it pretty much <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm i am uh, bro, i'm speaking up for men when it comes to weddings i'm tired of this <laughs> Look, that's really how, tell us how you really feel <laughs> really be like that yeah, yeah. you you are you did your planning. It's called the proposal. <laughs> <laughs> now, now she got to do hers. I said that though. Like when we were just, so at one point, my wife and I were reflecting, just you know, on everything, and I was like, the, "Y'all don't realize the proposal is the only part that the man really has creative control over, right?" So it's like it's it's about you, but it's not about you. Does yeah. that make sense? Like yeah. it's, we we make it special for you, right? Like it is. So it is, you know, it's targeted for you, right? But at the same time, like. That's the only part that yeah, I, it's all me. All. Yeah, yeah, like, you know what I mean? That's all me. Everything else from there on out, if you say yes, is is you, right? Yeah. And I'm just footing the bill. That's usually how it yeah, goes. Yeah, for the wedding. <laughs> right. Okay, yeah. How, so, many, how many arguments are we going to have about this? But, uh, yeah, okay. You good, Are you good on your point? Yeah, I was just saying, you know, you're a girlfriend. You, you pro- So, okay, my question time, is. Time, time, time. How long have I been together? Uh, yeah. Uh, what, you going to say there's a girlfriend getting in the front? Yeah, I, I was going to say, okay, so if the only thing about this argument changes is that she's a girlfriend, but it's still her car. Does she get in the back? Who? This is, her, this is where the when she said it was her car. Yeah. I'm driving. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so that that's how yeah, I was because nah, uh, you know, I was like, if the only thing changes is the fact that she's the girlfriend and not the wife, but it's still her vehicle, do you tell her to just uh, get in the you, back? Well, like, I, yeah, if it's I always make this joke. The one reason I always drive, people you know they want to sit. I'm driving, so I know where my seat's gonna be. <laughs> if it's my car, this is not this is not this is not even a car. I'm calling the police. <laughs> like you know, I'm just if it's you know if my name is on the title, please. This is not a con- this this is this is not you having an opinion, and I'm about to. Make a fact and put you in jail because you trespassed and about to commit grand theft auto. That's so that's not a it's like you're not making the payments on this joint, right? Nah, yeah, well, we prefer y'all to have no payments, but I got what you're saying, right? Y'all probably do have the payments, you're right, because y'all have the debt, so we prefer you to get out the debt, but yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. But uh, yeah, I mean, if it's let's say, yeah, I can, I can sort of touch on that. If the titles change, let, let's let's remove the car so it's, it's his car, right? okay? Because okay, I'm not. You know, but maybe looks <laughs> stupid. <laughs> no, I, that's I, why I had to ask for clarity, right? I was like, "Look, if the only thing changes the title, we'll be talking about." Because I was like, "I think she still has. I mean, it's her property, right? She yeah, can no, everybody no, no. on go home." Yeah, like, yeah, no. If this, if it is her car, she's on some type of legal documentation that's not the insurance. So she's on the title. She's on the loan. Right. This is not. This is like I said. Somebody going to jail. Yeah. <laughs> like something like this is you. You can't. You can't do what you want in somebody else's car. That's, that's Grand Theft Auto. This yeah, is Grand yeah, Theft yeah. yeah, This is now, now we're talking about calling the police and, and like, like, yeah, this is the name of New York. Somebody about to be in Rikers, mm-hmm. like so. <laughs> so yeah, but let's say it's, it's his car, or let's say it's the mom's car. Well, if the, mom, the mom's car, you're gonna have to deal with it, you know. But if it's let's say it's his car, right? And they're not married, right? So a girl and they're not engaged. So a girlfriend, it would be a time thing. But like you said, I say the same same thing. My mom would already be in the back instead of the chauffeur thing. My mom wouldn't be in the, right. wouldn't be in the back anyway. <laughs> so, she wouldn't get driven around. Exactly. So, Talk about let the windows down. Yeah. So it's like the, a blow yeah. my hair. Like, First of all, yeah. my mom in the car, and I got to deal with both of y'all. <laughs> How about that aspect of it? But in the, in the marriage, when you talk about the years of marriage, I say both of y'all would be the missus, the same missus in this situation because it's the man's side, it's the man's mom. So, you know, you'd have the same last name as his mom, and thus his wife would as well. So it's like, all right, Mrs. Insert your name here. Why are you acting like this? <laughs> I would, like you said, my, my mom would probably already be in the back. And not even like, because my mom, my, as you said, you would, it's on you to tell your mom to get in the back. Right. I, I think it's on your mom to know she's supposed to be in the back. I, if okay. You get your, if, if, she, if you know, I mean, you would already, I mean, like, right, you, right. Just, you don't randomly just pick up your wife. She's not a prostitute. But, you know, like, it's, it's going <clears> to, <throat> where's your wife at? You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Where's your wife at? And you in her car? You know what I mean? Right. I'm just putting every all the pieces together. But like, I would think that your your mom, the mother in law, would know that she got to get in the back anyways. Assuming obviously, so y'all don't think we'd be just being rude. There are no medical issues where she has to sit in the front. Like my like my grandma's, they sit in the front. Right. But you know that's because they. I, they I also feel everything. like grands trump everything though. Grands, grands. Oh, my grandma's yeah. a boy, well. I mean, my grandma's almost ninety. She, she. I feel like you gotta reobserve. <laughs> yeah. Because it's it's different, right? We talking about a whole two generation. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. the, the generation above my parents. Like mm-hmm. you, you, you bold if you ask my grandmother to get in the back. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? I think you think. No, I mean, like, I it's, like it's, it's more comfortable in the front. Like, that's where you're supposed to yeah. sit at and stuff like that. 
for all that type of stuff. I mean, not like, to mention my, my grandma got oxygen. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, leave That's my grandmother she, alone, yo. Like, she, <laughs> you know how hard it was to get her in the right, car? Right, get your ass in the back. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> We're not putting her in the car more times than we need to. <laughs> So that's that issue, but uh, yeah, I think if, if you, I mean, you would know, and then I think your mom, my, my eyes, your mom should already be, be in the back. Not not even that she would pull up in the front and get out without any conversation. Don't even create the scenario. That's what I call like optics and stuff. Don't even create the possibility of the problem. Cause now I'm not dealing with that. Well, your mom's in the front, you came got me, oh Lord have mercy. Jesus, she got in the back, we didn't even say nothing. Right. Yeah, I know, but why she gonna be in the front of my- Oh gosh. <laughs> Stupid. The lie. There you the go. Lies. This bitch. The lie. The lie. I'm not dealing with that. I also think that comes down to knowing who you with, right? Yeah. It, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I can, I can oh. definitely attest to the fact that my, I, my wife is very chill for the most part. Like, you know what I'm saying? And so she would just get in the back. She would. Just because. Okay, like, first she, off, we just going somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Has the location been altered because my mom is in the front seat? Yeah. Like, she don't care. Like, you know what I'm saying? My, as long as my wife still getting what my wife wants, she don't care. Like, it's really not that big of a deal. The airbag's like, safer in the back anyways. Because <laughs> that's where the kids go. Yeah, so you're you, more protected. Right. See, my job protect you. Hey. <laughs> like, yeah, so just know who you with, right? Like, you're, you know, your significant other probably, uh, if, if they... If they're your significant other, you know them well. They just gonna go, you know. They gonna go along with it. They gonna, they for the most part, they'll probably just just hop in the car and be be good, right? But I mean, I think I've been in a situation before, and my mom was already in the back, and I'm pretty sure my mom said she's gonna get in the back. But this thing too, I don't even think about it because I'm thinking, why are y'all fighting over this? That's what children do. We ain't calling no shotgun. Right. Or Mike and people call Mike Vic, but Bliss, right? I'm like, what are we playing no game? Just get in this car. We want to eat. Yeah. Look at that. That's what I'm saying too. Like we're about to go. Like also, tell them this thinking. What type of scenario are you in where you have your wife's car and you're with your mom and you have to go pick up your wife? Like, what what has happened that day? The only thing I could think of, maybe she had to do, again, because there's also a friend present, right? Which I'm right. assuming so is the wife's friend. Yeah. All that, but. yeah, you dropped her off, went to go pick moms up, came back to scoop the wife. You know what I mean? Like, time schedules just overlapped, right? Uh, no. And then... <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, like, no? I'm just trying to create this... Uh, uh, a actual scenario it's like where, this where, where are we at with your car where my mom is or isn't there and i have to go get her and come back and, get, and then your friend's here why is your friend here is she coming too like you know what i mean like this right. whole scenario is four people here it's a mom a mother-in-law and then a wife and a husband and a friend and your friend here sitting us also to you know me we're not doing this in public we assumed it's a friend maybe it's a cousin or something maybe it's uh, another family yeah, yeah. it could all be a family affair you know what i'm saying yeah but i mean look mom get in the back yeah, <laughs> as I said, just fix the damn plate. Yeah. No, I'm getting the back. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Just handle your business. All right. All right. Do you, have, do you have anything else? No, I'm good on that. What was my reply? No, it, he put that. No, I don't know. <laughs> you see how slow I scroll? Like, oh, what did I say? <laughs> Cause you know about the hey, room. some of these joints, man. You be, you be forgetting what you said on right. it. You be like, do I, do I still feel like that or do I not? Like, you good? No, I can't say what I was gonna say because it's about the people in World War II. Okay, oh, I can okay. say that part. Anyway, China made a post and was like, "Is it a religion or a race?" And yeah. Then I, okay. I, she 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 re, she re, she quote tweeted her yeah. old post, and I I was under the, the original post. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to make my original post statement underneath her, re, her retweet. <laughs> I'm like, dang, why am I in the mentions? <laughs> Were you gonna say something about? No, nah, I was gonna say we had that conversation at dinner yesterday. I saw it was that. Wild. Yeah. I saw it. It was just you and Via. It was me. So we went to an alpha event. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. we was with some people. people. Yeah, like oh, we wow. was out here, all from different, yeah, different places, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah states even, and uh, yeah, it was, it was an interesting conversation. I've come to the conclusion that nobody knows. Is it just those people? You're all discussing everything in general. Uh, so we were discussing the particular event involving, you know, oh, those people yeah. in World War Two. Yeah. It's both. It's a race and an ethnicity. But we look. I looked at the actual dip, so the Google definitions, and they're actually intercoupled. And that's why I, that's that proved to me that nobody knows the difference. Anyone.